I'm really passionate about people doing work that they love with people they like and doing it the way they want. Now in a franchise system, there's a whole, a whole bunch of guidelines and, and, and we actually call them systems. A system is a way of doing things. It's a proven way of doing things that makes sure that it's successful. So I like to think of it in terms of um, flexibility, um, framework and, and freedom. So we provide a framework, but within that framework, there's some flexibility. Uh, you know, why is that? Well, I mean, one of my favorite books is called Drive. It's by a guy called Daniel Pink. And he, he says, you know, what are, the, what are the things that make people the most engaged in the workplace? And he, he's come up with three things, autonomy, um, that the ability to do what you love the way you want, um, mastery, you know, the never ending pursuit of getting better at something and purpose, like doing work that's meaningful. So I think we can have, you know, a lot of autonomy within our work, but still work, you know, within certain guidelines. Back to the freedom piece. I mean, you know, I see a business as a vehicle to have the life you want, not, not an end unto itself, you know? So these businesses really can run, you know, largely without you. Um, I'm sitting here in a studio that's owned by a lady who has been a Pilates teacher for 30 years. This studio has been open for five months. She's shooting for 150 members. She's got 120. She's working Tuesday morning and Wednesday night teaching classes, which is a huge back off for her. Um, helps her a lot actually, because, um, you know, it's just much easier on her body. You know, opening a new studio, there's a, like five phases, I think, there's pre-opening, um, you know, all the work that's got to be done before we open. There's usually a bit of capital outlay and there's not much income coming in. And then there's launch, you know, when we first launch, the first few months, then we go through a phase of growth and then we go through a phase of uh, stability and then we go through a phase of potential leverage and scale where you can you can back off and that can all happen within the first sort of six or 12 months so i call it uh, 12 months to freedom actually but that's where you know you, you i've always been motivated by by building up a strong income but also building up an asset that's worth something and that's what you can do with business ownership not to mention that franchises can often sell for more than a standalone business